Hello, I'm Claire Smith and welcome to my channel. So today I've got quite a weird, slightly random video for you, just a short one. So I was just thinking to myself the other day, I was looking at my perfume and I was thinking, how long, if I stopped buying perfume, how long would it take me to use up every single drop? And I decided to work it out and I just thought maybe somebody else might be thinking this too and might be interested to know the answer. Probably not, but you know, Anyway, I'm putting it in a video, so here we go. So the first thing we need to work out is how many sprays are there in a perfume? So thankfully the Makeup Breakup have come to my rescue on this one and they've already done the experiment. So they took a 30ml bottle of Britney Spears Rainbow Fantasy and they sprayed it from beginning to end from new. And they found that that bottle contained 610 sprays and plus a few splutters, but we'll just ignore that for the sake of the calculation. So that's 610 sprays in 30 mils of perfume. So then we need to ask ourselves, how much perfume do I own? So I own 46 different perfumes, a few more bottles than that, because I have multiples of some perfumes. And in total, when I added up the volume, it came to around 1600 ml, which in the US, if you want a conversion, is 54 fluid ounces, um, which is 3.37 US pints or 2.8 UK pints. So the next question is, how much perfume do I use in one year? So this is gonna be highly dependent on the type of perfume that you're using. If you're using something say like, I don't know, Tom Ford Black Orchid, you're gonna use one or two sprays because it's a strong perfume. Whereas if you're wearing something like, I don't know, Glossier U, you might use quite a few sprays because that's one of those, you might not really be able to smell it yourself even though others can smell it on you. So you might spray a bit more. So I'm going to just set an arbitrary amount and I'm gonna say that I use on average three sprays of perfume per day. So say I was using that 30 ml bottle of the Britney Spears Rainbow Fantasy, that means that it would take me 203.3 days to go through one of those bottles. So just a little over half a year, around seven months. So time for the actual proper calculation now. So I'm gonna scoot over to the side so I can write it up in the corner there. So how many days of perfume do I have? So we need to take the volume that I have, so the approximately 1600 ml, divide it by 30 ml to find the number of bottles of equivalent Rainbow Fantasy I have, and then take that number and times it by the number of sprays and divide it by the number of sprays I use per day, which will give me approximately 10,800 days worth of perfume. So how many years is 10,800 days? Well, it's nearly 30 years, it's 29.6 years. So how old will I be when I use up all this perfume? And that's, you know, relying on me not buying any more from the time being, and none of this going off. I will be 66. Me not buying any more perfume is quite a big assumption. Yeah, that also assumes that all sprayers spray the same volume. It makes the assumption that perfume won't go off. It makes the assumption that I can actually use every single last drop of the perfume. Sometimes bottles are designed in a way that means you can't access all of the perfume. It also presumes that I want to use all this perfume and that I won't declutter. It also presumes that I won't buy any more perfume. So yeah, I'm gonna leave the little equation down below and you can work it out for yourselves if you're interested. Um, and all you need to do is to work out the roughly the number of sprays you think you use per day and the rough volume of perfume in your collection. And please drop the answers down below. I'd love to know what you think about this and how accurate you think this equation is. So yeah, that answers my question. I was just really, really curious. It just, it just got me thinking. I'm a scientist, I can't help it. So if you've enjoyed this video, then please give it a like, or if you just found it entertaining, please give it a like. And please let me know how much perfume you think you've got and how long it will be before you use it up and how old you will be by the time you use it up. And consider subscribing because I do lots of perfume videos, not all as weird as this one. Some of them are really quite sensible. And yeah, I also do empties and I also do favourites videos. So if that's the kind of thing that interests you, then please consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.